Today we'll talk about call center analytics, areas to analyze, and how to take action on what you've learned. First up, what are call center analytics? Call center analytics is simply the data you acquire when you interact with your customers. It isn't rocket science. Genius Albert Einstein, sounds like you have the answers. Yeah, like totally, it's all in the data. That's the key, okay? It may not be complicated, but analyzing data from customer interactions is super important. Studying the data can lead to things like cost reduction, better call agent performance, and an overall better customer experience. So, what data should you look at first? Here's what you need to know. Operational metrics. This includes call volume, the level of service provided, and the queue times. Right, by collecting data on call queue times, for example, you might find that certain times of day consistently show longer wait times. This lets you know it's time to allocate more staff during these periods or improve call routing strategies to manage the load more effectively. Call agent performance. How many first call resolutions do they have per hour? What's their average call time? If your agents are talking with customers for longer periods of time, that might not be ideal depending on your business goals. Customer satisfaction. If only there was some video explaining ways to measure these. There is. The link is in the description. Eureka! There's a link in the description below. I think we've solved it. Some other data to examine might include things like cost per call and revenue generation. But what if there was a way to predict call volume in the future? A way to analyze data like call volume during different seasons, product launches, or promotional campaigns. But how? Just use your computer, like with all the other data we've talked about. Gah! What is this? When you analyze your call center data, certain things might become clear, like long-term performance trends. Do some agents answer certain questions better than others? That's valuable information for training your call agents. Once you've gathered all of your data, here's how to take action based on your analytics. First. You'll need clear objectives. Find the areas where the call center needs improvement and set specific goals. Then, work with your teams to form strategies for improvement. New training, new technology, cool hacks, whatever helps. After that, make sure resources are going to the right places. Do certain areas need more staff, budget? Then start acting on your strategies. Train agents, update processes, and deploy new technologies where needed. Make sure everyone involved understands their roles and responsibilities. You'll also want to keep track of how your call center is progressing. Use key performance indicators and other metrics to measure how effective these changes are and make adjustments when you need to. Why is your music so much more dramatic than mine? Because I'm a genius with the cool hat. Also, be sure to communicate with your team. Call center performance is constantly changing and there are always going to be new challenges. That's why communication is so important. Give your managers and agents the opportunity to tell you what they need. And remember to celebrate. <gasps> celebrate happy times. Oh yeah. Tell them mine. Celebrating achievements and improvements can boost morale and motivation. If you're feeling like this process is a little intimidating, Nextiva can help. With Nextiva, you can track and analyze data all in a single platform. To see what features are available, follow the link in the description. So now we know how to analyze calls into data. But A is to address. Then we learned how to take the action. Fit two small peas into pot, huh? Want to learn more? Dive deeper via the blog link in our description. Have another business communications question? Ask in the comments. And as always, like, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next vlog powered by Amazing Service. Until next time. This is incredible. I see that general relativity helped humans land on the moon.